This thing I've been reading, Chateau Artiste. It's about like dating women. It's like a pickup book, you know? I know some of you are gonna be like, Henry, why are you reading pickup books, bro? Are you, you know, are you just, are you, are you, do you not care about the women? Are, are you just trying to sleep with them or something? That's sleazy. It was funny because I was talking to a couple guys and I was like, um, I was like, yeah, I'm reading this book. And they're like, yeah, this stuff sounds bad, bro. <laughs> the thing is, I think if you want a good woman, if you want to learn how to make women feel good, if you want to, you know, keep her, you need a lot of experience. The guys I, I, I was asked, I was talking to about the book, one, one was married. One has a girlfriend who kind of long, a little bit long distance, but um, I don't know. You know, I'm not trying to trash these guys. You know, these guys are better than me because they've been with with women. I was the only virgin, so they're they're better than me. And the, so I'm not trying to trash them. But the thing is, you know, they haven't been with a lot of women. Uh, and also, you know, so. I want to see what it's like, you know, if I'm if I'm with a lot of women, if I've been with a lot of women. You know, I've met guys who were like, who have like a bunch of women, like in different places, but they seem like they have low energy. Um, you know, they were interesting people for sure, but they like low energy. I don't know, kind of, kind of like all over the place. It's weird. Um, so I want to see what it's like. How much will it change me if I practice this stuff from this book, you know? How much it will help me? Because the thing is, I want to help other men too, you know, the guys who are, who are virgins. Like me, the guys who are, who are incels. Or at least the guys who haven't had sex in like years. And they want to. And I'm like, I want to help those guys too. Because those... There's, I know a lot of men who are like good people, you know, good, you know, but they, they, and I think they deserve a girlfriend. They deserve a woman because a woman, a good woman, she will bring like peace into your life. She will help you to work harder, you know? And, and I see these guys, these men, these guys are, you know, hardworking men. But when I go to their house, their their place is like dirty, you know, they're tired. I'm just like, fuck. These guys need a good woman. Luckily, myself, I'm able I'm able to work hard but have a good mood because I'm drinking my I'm drinking, I'm staying hydrated. I'm drinking sugar water. I'm eating rice. I'm eating fruit. And I'm and I'm also Christian. I love God, so praying and being grateful. Having an attitude of gratitude will really help your life. You know, I'm grateful I have this phone so I can put up videos to help other men out there. Anyways, and I, so I want to help these men. I want to help them. I want to help. I want to be their wingman so they can get girls. The thing is, I don't have a girlfriend. You know, I'm a virgin. And so I want to read this book. And head over to the Philippines and just gain a lot of experience dating women there. Um, you know, I'm not going to try to date women around me. Um, I mean, if something happens around here, like if I meet a woman and she's into me, um, you know, yeah, I'll, for sure I'll try it. I'll try out the things I've learned from Chateau Artiste, this the dating book. Um, but one of my fears is getting in a relationship with women. Um, you know, every time I get in a relationship with a woman, I have anxiety. I have, um, I get stressed, you know, I'm like, when is she going to break up with me? Um, you know, I'm like, cause it's not natural for me to make, to, um, kind of be like, you know, smooth with the women, be very seductive. So it's like something I need to learn, but it's, it's like super scary and unnatural for me, but I want to do it. Um, so yeah, I've been reading this book. And I've been asking these guys, I'm like, you know, what they think of it. But a lot of them, you know, they haven't. But anyways, you know, like I said, a good woman, 
she's gonna make you happier. She's gonna give you more energy. If you've worked, if you worked a hard day today, and you go home, she's gonna have food for you. The place is cleaned up. She's gonna wash your clothes. You're gonna smell good, and then you're gonna work hard again the next day. And you gotta make sure you're able to fuck her really good. And she's gonna be like, you know, she's gonna wanna, she's gonna, she's gonna wanna support you and stuff. Um, but this book is, it, it's teaching me so much, you know, for example, like, you know, she's not the priority. My, our mission is the priority and she wants that, you know, at first I never understood why would she want me to focus on my mission and not her, but now I understand, you know, um, she gets turned on by us being on our mission. Whatever that is, working on bikes, uploading on YouTube, social media, whatever. She sees that and she's like, she's like biting her lips, biting her. Mm. And I understand why, you know. Um, it, I mean, if, if you watch other people who are getting it done, doesn't that push, motivate you? Doesn't that make you feel good? Like, man, I want to get out there today and ride my bike. I want to up, start uploading on YouTube. So imagine a woman when she's in a relationship with a man and she sees that he's on his mission. She loves that. Um, and in turn, she's going to want to support you so you can keep doing it. Um, so that's what makes a good woman. Now, there are women who aren't going to support you. They're going to be combative. They're going to be, um, you know, they probably don't know how to cook. <laughs> Maybe, but maybe she, she gives you good head. I don't know. <laughs> but, um, you know, anyways. So that's why I want to read this book. Because I want to, I want to learn how to get a good woman. And so that way I can teach the these guys, these men in, who, who are my friends, my coworkers. I want to teach them how to get a good girl so that they can keep working hard. So that they can feel happy. So that, you know, I just want to make the world a better place. So that's, 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 the, you know, that's my, that's my virgin, you know, thoughts, right? Freaking, you know, 30, 30 year old virgin is like, this is what I'm thinking. But, uh, but I'm going to upload when I'm in the Philippines. I'm going to upload, I'm going to, I'm going to talk about my experiences there. I plan on going, I want, I really want to go already. Um, I want to go for tomorrow, but, uh, I plan on going in, uh, I don't know. I really want to go in October. Uh, I might end up going in December, but I don't care how much the ticket's going to cost. I'm excited for the adventure. You know, I'm, where, where am I going to stay? You know, where am I, what, what's it going to be like riding my bike around? I'm like, super excited. I really want to go, but, um, yeah, that's, that's the book, you know? Um, please comment, tell me what your thoughts are, you know, Henry should, you just gotta, he's gotta, <laughs> are you, do you have a good woman who's helping you to work hard? Is she bringing, like, more happiness to, in your life? If she's not, you know, I appreciate your advice, but, you know, I'll think about it. Anyways, 